C I E D N C E R T presents audiobook of mathematics for class 4 titled Math Magic Book 4 Textbook in Mathematics for class 4 Chapter 6 titled The Junk Seller Part 2 Page number 64 Smart Kiran sells the junk There is a picture given here of Kiran on page number 64 talking to someone on the mobile phone Kiran sells her junk to a big shop She checks the prices on her mobile phone and sells only when she gets a good price Today she has gone to sell plastic newspaper iron and brass at Dinu's big shop Dinu weighs 32 kg of iron 4 kg of brass, 152 kg of newspaper and 63 kg of plastic. There are two pictures given here on page number 64. In the first picture, two hand carts are given along with two hand cart operators. In the second picture, a junk seller's shop has been given. Here, many cartons are given in the picture. Page number 65 A How much will Dinu pay for 63 kg of plastic The rate of 1 kg plastic is rupees 12 So the cost of 63 kg plastic will be rupees 12 into 63 Remember you used boxes to multiply two numbers in class 3 There is a rate list given here in a blue box on page number 65. This rate list is of Dinu's. There are two columns given in this rate list. The first column reads kind of junk and the next column reads price of 1 kg. In the first kind of junk it is written newspaper. The price of 1 kg newspaper is rupees 6. The next one is iron. The cost given is rupees 14. The third kind of junk is brass. The price of 1 kg brass is rupees 180. Fourth one is plastic. For 1 kg plastic, the cost is rupees 12. The fifth kind of junk is waste paper. The price of 1 kg waste paper is 4 rupees and 50 paisa. Here on page number 65 the box has been given to multiply two numbers that was used in class 3. On page number 65 the graphic of an ant is given. The ant says 12 into 63 means 12 times 63. Twelve times sixty is seven hundred and twenty. So the answer is more than seven twenty. Also, the answer is less than eight hundred. Can you tell why? Dinu added the numbers in the boxes: six hundred plus one hundred and twenty plus thirty plus six is equal to. Seven hundred and fifty-six. So, for sixty-three kg plastic, Dinu will give rupees seven hundred and fifty-six. Kiran bought one kg plastic for rupees ten, but sold one kg plastic for rupees twelve. How much money does she earn on selling one kg plastic? Rupees dash. So, how much money does she earn? For sixty-three kg, rupees dash. Page number sixty-six. B. Kiran sells thirty-two kg iron. How much money will Dinu pay for thirty-two kg iron? Kiran buys one kg iron for rupees twelve, but sells it for rupees fourteen. How much does she earn when she sells thirty-two kg? Iron, rupees dash. C. What will Dinu pay for one fifty-two kg newspaper? 
the rate of 1 kg newspaper is rupees 6 so the cost of 152 kg newspaper is rupees 6 into 152 dinu writes there is a box given here on page number 66 this box is the multiplication box used to multiply two numbers which was taught in class 3 the graphical ant says 6 into 100 is equal to 600 so the answer is more than 600 is the answer less than 1000 how did you guess then he adds the numbers in the boxes 600 plus 300 plus 12 is equal to 912 there is a picture given here of Kiran, the junk seller. There is a talking box given along with her picture. Kiran says, I bought 1 kg newspaper for rupees 5, but sold it for rupees 6. How much money did I earn by selling 152 kg of newspaper? Dash. So, for 152 kg newspaper, he will give Kiran rupees 912 d what does dinu pay for brass how much money will dinu pay for 4 kg brass dash there is a talking bubble given here of the graphical black ant says guess the answer first page number 67 first guess the answer and then calculate a 37 into 18 is equal to B. 45 into 24 is equal to dash C. 69 into 52 is equal to dash D. 77 into 55 is equal to dash E. 142 into 5 is equal to dash F. 382 into 3 is equal to dash g 2 into 175 is equal to dash h 4 into 206 is equal to dash fill my diary kiran bought some junk from the junk collectors she paid them rupees 841 she sold the junk at dinu's big shop and dinu gave her these notes and coins here on page number 67, the pictures of different notes and coins given by Dinu have been given. Kiran wrote the record in her diary. The notes and coins given here are 6 notes of rupees 100, 7 notes of rupees 20, 8 notes of rupees 5, 3 notes of rupees 50. 6 notes of rupees 10 and 4 coins of rupees 1. Kiran wrote the record in her diary. The date of the diary is 11th March 2007. Kiran writes, Money I paid rupees 841. Money I got rupees 600, rupees 150, rupees 140. Rupees 60, Rupees 40 and Rupees 4. Total Rupees are 994. Rupees 994 minus Rupees 841 is equal to Rupees 153. That is money I earned. Page number 68. Later, she paid rupees 919 to the junk collectors. When she sold the junk, she got these notes and coins from Dinu. Here on page number 68, pictures of different notes and coins given by Dinu to Kiran have been given. 28 coins of rupees 5, 5 notes of rupees 100, 1 note of rupees 50. 18 notes of rupees 10 9 notes of rupees 20 Now, you make a record in her diary. 
find out how much she earned this time here on page number 68 a blank page of 18th march 2007 of a diary has been given you were just listening to chapter 6 titled the junk seller part 2 with it chapter 6 of total 14 chapters ends here voice over artists shalini singh and webhav shrivastav sound recordists butelang lingdo and vikas sangwan assistance in production by shanu muksim and amit kumar producer vimlesh choudhary this book was presented to you by ciet ncert new delhi india